Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Arai and I'm going to talk about what design and technology is all about. The moment you step into my classroom, you're not a student anymore, you're a designer. And what we do in this room as a designer is we constantly ask questions about how we can improve on certain designs, aesthetics, functionality. As an example, have you ever picked up a remote and ever thought, why are there 50 buttons on this thing that make it look so ugly and so hard to use? So what we do is we try to come up with solutions. As an example, uh, my year 11s have come up with a TOI camera uh, made out of wood uh, and now they're moving on to a new project which is about sustainable lighting. So how can we actually improve on these designs to make it more sustainable for the environment, sustainable for uh, in terms of cost as well uh, and these are the questions we ask in design and technology. So I hope to see you in my class. Hello students and parents, I would like to provide some information on stage 5 information and software technology. Today we live in the digital age or the information age. We need to be digitally literate. What is digital literacy? Digital literacy amongst many other things involves skills like using technology such as computer, internet effectively, effective online communication, Finding, using, and critically evaluating online information. Communicating, collaborating, and participating in online environments. Creating digital content, including online content, and not just using it. Why do we need to be digitally literate? Digital literacy is crucial for your social life, learning life, and working life. The following report, how are young people faring in the transition from school to work, outlines these findings. 90% of future jobs will involve digital literacy. 35% of 15 year olds are not digitally literate. What will you learn from information and software technology in terms of digital literacy? The ability to operate a variety of hardware and software, Teamwork experience, an understanding of information or computer systems, ability to apply management techniques to solve information technology problems, valuable transferable skills in many areas of information technology. So IST prepares you for a wide range of post-school and future career opportunities. In IST, you will study subjects such as designing solutions, data handling, hardware and software, past, current and emerging technologies, people in information technology, issues related to computer technology, database design, digital media, authoring and multimedia, internet and website development. You will get to experience using a wide range of hardware and software. You will participate in innovative and challenging projects. These are some examples of projects created by 9 and 10 IST. This is a database. This is a table. This is a form with a drop down menu and images inserted and in all that. Um, this is a query, the design view. And this is a report. This is a website, a series of web pages created and then linked. and um, this is the HTML coding that was used to create the first page. And this is done from scratch. This is what the first page looks like. The menu is used to navigate and uh, it allows all the web pages to be linked together to create a website. 
This is a presentation, an interactive two way interactivity in this presentation. So, if you want to have a look at um, uh, any of the hardware devices, for example, the input device, and you want to look at the keyboard, you can go and have a look at it. And then um, go back to the input devices, and you can have a look at the other ones, go back and look at the other types of hardware devices. So, a two way interactivity in this particular um, task. This is uh, an example of a digital media product. The um, illustrator has been used to create this logo step by step. And the students have to document all the steps until that is complete. Then the logo is used for business card, front, back, and Another digital media product is a newsletter. Everything put together into one page. And um, in this uh, digital media uh, project, the students use uh, Photoshop, Illustrator, and um, whatever online applications that they like to use. So they have a freedom to use any application that they want to create this particular one. So, the knowledge and skills from IST can be transferred directly to further education and your future jobs. Information and software technology basically prepares you for a wide variety of future career paths and post-school opportunities. Thank you.